I've already shuffled and we'll be taking a look at the overall energy. We'll take a look and see what's coming up. We'll see what the challenge is going to be. And then we'll take a look and see what the outcome is. So Aquarius, this is going to be a basic general reading. It's not my usual love reading, but if you're looking for a love reading, I have several new ones on my channel. So after you watch this, take a look at the home page and you can find my new love readings for Aquarius and any other sign. So once again, this is just a bonus basic general reading for Aquarius for the rest of February 2021. So Aquarius, the overall energy. Well, we've got the Sun card and it's with the Queen of Pentacles. So this is telling me with the Queen of Pentacles here is that you could feel like you just want comfort. For some of you Aquarius, you could start to feel like you just, you're okay with just being at home. Just doing you, falling back, and just taking, taking joy and comfort in the ordinary things. Maybe just being with your dog or your cat. Um, babysitting your niece or nephew. Just being at home. Just falling back. That's what the Queen of Pentacles can do. And it's with the Sun card. The card above the word energy. Um, it's indicating that there's something that is making you happy. Or something coming up that's going to make you really, really happy. Yeah, you see that little baby there? He's running around, he's chasing lollipops under some sunflowers, yeah, and he's just happy. The sun card is about happy times, just something, something that's making you really happy. And I say coming up because as we move on over and take a look at what's coming up, the card above the word present is justice. Now, justice can be about karma. It can be about the law of cause and effect. And it's with the Three of Pentacles. So, Three of Pentacles. Well, in this deck, it doesn't look really, really happy. Three of Pentacles, the card below the word present. Someone could have... Or someone that you know, I'm um, getting, they were supposed to offer you something. It could have been teamwork, collaboration. It could have been some type of benefits that were due to you. Could have been something like that with this Three of Pentacles. Um, it could have been about the two of you. We're supposed to get on the same page, but it didn't happen. Instead, this person, they did you wrong. They were all about trying to benefit themselves instead of coming together with you and doing the right thing. They didn't do that. They didn't do the right thing by you. And some type of justice you felt needed to be served because this person did you wrong and if it didn't happen yet something like this could be coming up yeah you feel like this person needs to feel the way they made you feel because lately you've just been wanting to stay in the house and just just fall back but something is something is making you feel like justice needs to be served and because justice is here it's indicating that your person could be about could they they could be about to get theirs whatever they did to you it's about to 
come back to them. And you know what they say about karma. Karma can be about whatever you do to people or whatever you put out to the universe. It comes back to you. And they say when it's karma, it comes back three or ten times as much or or it comes back a whole lot bigger. So yeah, your person was supposed to offer you something. Something was yours and they, they probably kept it. Yeah. Something that the Three of Pentacles can be about, like I said, it can be about an offer or they were supposed to do some type of teamwork with you, but they got greedy about it. And maybe they didn't mention it to you. Something you found out, or you will be finding out. And this person with justice here, their day is coming. Or it's about to come. Or it has come. That's what I'm trying to say with justice. Justice will be served. So, let's move on over. Let's take a look and see what the challenge is. Now we got the Queen of Swords and it's with Three of Wands. Well, like I said, it's indicating that your person could be getting theirs with justice here. Whatever they did to you, it's, it's hitting them. Three times or ten times as big. They're being paid back for the wrong that they did you. So it looks like you're ready to get up out of your seat. The Queen of Swords, the card above the word challenge. You're feeling good. They got what they deserved. You can put the sword down. She's got this huge sword in her hand. You are having your defenses up. If they came anywhere near you, you felt like you would have... You would have cut them. So you're getting up out of that chair that she's in. And and you're feeling like this Three of Wands. The card that's below the word challenge. Three of Wands is about finally making a decision. And you're going forward. You could start to feel like your ship has finally arrived. So you're feeling good these days. Yeah. You're getting, like I said, you're getting up out of that chair finally. You've been sitting there for for a long time, probably, ever since your person did you wrong. And you're putting down that sword, and you're, you're ready to go back to being you. Yeah. You found out they, that your person that did you wrong, they're getting what they deserve. And it's making you, actually, it's making you feel good. Not that we wish bad on anyone on this channel, but yeah, there is this thing called karma. You can't just go around treating people any kind of way and not expect something to happen or not expect to be paid back. So, yeah, we don't wish bad on anyone, but yeah, there is that lady named Karma and she's showing up in this reading. Somebody did you wrong, and the outcome is showing the devil ends with the Page of Cups. Now, the devil can be about greed, envy, materialism, addictions. It can be um, maybe a devil type of energy. It can be a very toxic energy. Maybe it's just, it can be like um, some type of challenging struggle. Because you see, if you can see in the picture of the devil card, the card that's above the word outcome, these two people at the bottom of the card, they're chained at the neck. Chained and bound to the devil. So what I'm getting is that this is your person. They're going through some type of struggle. You know they did you wrong, and it's been affecting you ever since you found out they didn't do right by you. You just stayed stuck in the house with your sword in your hand, only not seeing any friends, and just in the confines of your house, not really wanting to be out and be social. You found out that they're getting theirs. They're going through something now, some type of really big struggle. 
A lot of you have a heart, though, because a page of cups here. Page of cups, the card below the word out outcome. It can be about opening your heart and reaching out to someone, maybe with a message or visit. So, some of you do have a heart. You don't want to see this person go through hell, even though they put you through hell and they didn't do right by you. So some of you are actually reaching out to this person. You see they're in a struggle now. And they're going through something really challenging with the devil card here. Yeah. So. That's your reading, Aquarius. It's just a general basic reading. Don't forget, I do have love readings up. And the next reading for Aquarius will be a new love reading also. In the next maybe four or five days. So I hope you enjoy the reading. I hope it resonates. As you know, general readings, they do not resonate with everyone. Then again, if you like the reading, please comment, subscribe. Hit the notification bell. That way you'll be notified when I post my next reading. I'll also put a link below of the extended of this reading. Where I'll go over how you feel about the situation. And much more. So, Aquarius, thank you so much for watching. I hope all of you are doing well and staying safe during this crazy virus season. Hang in there, it's going to pass, and we'll all get through this. So, stay strong, take good care. I hope you come back and join me for the next Aquarius reading. Like I said, it will be a love reading. And I do have new love readings up already, so go ahead and check those out. Those are on the home page of my YouTube channel. So Aquarius, I can never say it enough. I thank you so very much for watching. I hope you have a great day. I hope to see you at the next reading and take care.